This is Red Eye, a lightweight anti-aircraft missile whose purpose is to turn fast, low-flying enemy aircraft into dead pigeons. Carrying a contact warhead containing one pound of TNT, Red Eye attains a speed of Mach 2.5 swift enough to intercept planes flying at speeds up to 400 knots. Red Eye, weighing a total of 23 pounds for missile and launcher combined, is easily handled by one man. An optical sight frames the target, and a reticle permits the gunner to take a lead in much the same way a duck hunter does. An infrared sensing element in the nose of Red Eye picks up heat rays emitted by the plane's engine. This information is fed into a miniature computer that directs a proportional navigation system. Changes in course are affected by vanes in the body of the missile. These ultra-high speed pictures show how Red Eye is launched by an expulsion charge. Once clear, a sustainer rocket motor cuts in and the missile arms itself. Range is 3,500 meters to an altitude of 9,000 feet. Should the missile miss the target, it will self-destruct after 10 seconds. A single shot kill probability of 30% against jets and 50% against prop-driven aircraft brings the cost of destroying a plane below that of 50 caliber ammunition. Red-Eye teams will be attached to frontline units. Two men and 12 missiles carried in a jeep will comprise each unit and replace 50 caliber anti-aircraft machine guns. Development is in the system and flight testing phase. It is expected that Red-Eye will be type classified in the fiscal year 1964. As an instructor looks on, Red Eye, one-man defense system, goes against an aerial target. 